Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I am here with Trevor, former contestant and fan. <laughs> well, Trevor, we are excited to find you a match tonight, but we're not going to find you love just by ourselves. Here to help you. So passionate are they for your cause. Please welcome Courtney Cox and Nick Kroll. <laughs> So, I mean, this is a crackpot team to help you find someone. I'm not going to find something now. It's I mean, never come on. Happen. Well, look, let's get to know you a little better. You're a professional dancer. Mm -hmm. You uh, have recently moved to California. Yes. Uh, what are you looking for in, in a man? What, what are you <clears> looking for? I think for me, because I'm in so many different situations, uh, I need someone I can take to my family, and then also someone I can take to an event, but also someone I can take to the club and just get crazy, and then <laughs> someone I can take to Starbucks and, like, sit on my laptop and update my resume, and they can just sit there and smile at me and look cute. <laughs> wow, so you're looking for a mute. You're looking <laughs> for... <laughs> yeah, you're looking yeah. for the perfect person who's not going to judge you, will go everywhere you want them to go, <laughs> be silent when you ask them to, but always be there at your beck and call. Yes. I think we're starting to work out why you might be single. <laughs> All right, now, Trevor, it's time to see your perfect... to see if your perfect match is here tonight. It's time to play Late Late Live Tinder. <laughs> OK, here's how it will work. The guys will come out one at a time. You will take your big foam finger. You will swipe right if you like the guy <laughs> or left if you don't. Guys who get a right swipe will so take right a seat. Yes, yeah. yeah, they will get a seat on one of these stools. Guys who swipe left will be forced to fall into the ball pit of doom and terror. <laughs> now, swipe wisely, Trevor, you only have three guys to make it to the next round. You've been one of those three guys. I know how it feels. You know how it feels. <laughs> Let's get started. Let's bring out our first contestant. <laughs> This is John, 34. Courtney, what's your first thoughts when you see John there? Definitely take him home to meet the family. <laughs> wow. That's it. Yeah, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not sure about the club yet. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, what, what do you think, Nick? What's your thoughts? I think you should get married to him. <laughs> oh, so this is I, love love. I love love. I love love, Trevor. Trevor, it's not our decision. What are you thinking about John? Good hair, nice Good, face. Yes, I was just going to comment the hair. Good hair. Like, I'm, a, I'm a hair person. Yeah. So. yeah. Oh, oh, John, yeah. straight onto the screen. Okay. Let's bring out our next contestant. Uh -oh. Okay, this is Ron Air. Now, I will say Ron Air looks like he may have been to the gym. Yeah. <laughs> and he's not afraid for us to see that in such a tight <laughs> Ron Air. Uh, okay. Uh... Run out. <laughs> what are your thoughts, Nick? Um, what do you think? Trevor, Nick? I think you should marry him. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to go to Courtney. Are we... Yeah, we're going to go to are Courtney. Just... <laughs> yeah. Courtney, what do we think of, uh, of Run Out? I think, I don't know. I think I, I like it. I like, I like him. It. The I question like... is, Trevor, do you want to <laughs> climb Mount Runair or not? I mean, that's. <laughs> That's the truth of it. Well, That's the truth of it. Know, and I think you're... Out, right? Listen, this is the thing. If you fill the seats, but then someone comes out that you prefer, oh. you can switch out. Oh, oh Ronell, take a seat on the stool. <laughs> Trevor, this is too easy. <laughs> We're two for two here. OK, let's bring out our next contestant. OK, now, obviously, Corey and Renair have been shopping at the same store. <laughs> but is there an offer on on these shirts? Is, is, is that he is? OK. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> look at that smile! Corey, stop it. I know, the <laughs> eyes. What do you think? What do you think, Corey? What do you reckon? I like him, too. Yeah. I do. I think this is good. Awesome. I feel like Corey's going to be a man for all occasions. You know what else I think? When you're in the... Club, as you you know, and you're dancing. Mm -hmm. I think Corey's just going to stand at the side mm -hmm. and be like, mm -hmm. look at Trevor. Yeah. 
That's and what when, I'm looking for. That's what I yeah. And when you are walking up the aisle, <laughs> and he's waiting up there, I don't know. I just think it's, I don't know. I think you guys should get married. Best man? <laughs> Only if you're the best man. What do you Sorry. think, Trevor? What do you think of Troy? Oh, yes, he's so. made a seat. position where we're gonna see some more guys but there's a few more contestants out there and if you prefer them you can switch them out okay don't look surprised by this one here welcome to Tinder baby Ronell's like <laughs> what I thought you knew this okay let's meet our next contestant With a wink, did you see it? Yeah. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think, Connie? Uh, he came out with confidence. I, mm. I don't know. Um, I think the sizing is interesting, mm -hmm. but um, <laughs> no, I just think that's Great what it's a good so point. Well, yeah. It's a good it's point. A, you gotta think of it. Be good. You gotta yeah. think of it. Yeah, you gotta think, think of what, how you yeah. like yeah. it to be. <laughs> how you like to hold somebody? I mean, yeah. that's a thought. I mean, it's like a little pocket Adam Levine. <laughs> I mean, if anyone knows what it feels like to be a pocket Adam Levine, it's Nick Clark. <laughs> it's, true. it's true. I like the stubble. Yeah. I love the stubble I because... Like this, oh, there's a personality no. there. I do, you I feel there is a personality behind. there? Mm -hmm. Yes, I, I do. I'm, I'm like I marriage material? <laughs> <laughs> I think there's a personality there, and I think, I think he's got a nice way about him, a lovely face. The question is, are you going to switch him out for John or not? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to say we're in there. You're going to switch oh. out Ronnie. Oh, Ronnie. Yeah. Ronnie, have a seat. Oh. <laughs> OK, you run here, you take your seat, pass the microphone over. You've got to go into the ball pit. Well done. <laughs> Okay, let's bring out our next contestant. Oh, That's hard. Hey, Jude. <laughs> I mean, he just took a sad song and made it better, didn't he? I mean, come on. Come oh, wow. on. What are our thoughts, Trevor? What do you think? I don't know. I'm a big personality, and I need someone to be able to hold their ground and, like, not let me walk all over them, because that's eventually... If you let me do it, I'm going to be like, go make your bed. I need dinner. Yeah. I need th and I don't want to be that person, oh. but if you let me do it, I'm going to do it, right? Well, if you're going to do it, you're going to do it. But what is it? What is it about you that makes you think you could walk all over him? If I'm honest, I I'd, I'd let him walk all over me. <laughs> Happily. <laughs> You gotta make a decision, Trevor. You're gonna switch out, or is he in the ball pit? Swipe. <gasps> you want... oh. Who are you switching? God, you're a maverick who refuses yes. to play by the rules, Trevor. Who are you gonna switch out, Trevor? Who's it gonna be? I really liked you, um, but John. Oh, John. Is, is John, you were so close. I'm gonna take a chance on something different. Jude, take a seat on the three chairs. John, we loved having you here, John. Oh. Well, that's it. We've got our three contestants. OK. So, Trevor, it's now your time. So, Trevor, ask you, what is your question to the guys? And then we'll go down. Corey, to Jude, what is, what is your question, Trevor? So, me being a dancer... We can lose this now. This is... <laughs> OK. <laughs> me being a dancer, music is very important to me. So, who's your favourite musical artist and why? Oh. Oh, good question. OK, Corey. Favorite musical artist and why? I have to say Lady Gaga. I just feel like she's uh, done a lot of different things and kind of mixed between genres a lot, and I appreciate that. Mm. Oh. There was. Good answer. Good answer. A woman, a woman behind said, I'd like to say Lady Gaga, and a woman gasped behind. <gasps> oh my God. Shocking. <laughs> Lady Gaga. So Lady Gaga, good choice. Okay, Stephen, what about you? Favorite artist, hands down, Whitney Houston. She oh, gave yeah. me hope. I was a gay kid that grew up in rural Missouri, and she gave me hope for a better world. Okay. And 
and choose. Favourite recording artist and why? My favourite recording artist right now is Tina Turner because she's a Sagittarius mm -hmm. and she has been through some struggles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> OK, so there we've got it. Okay. Gaga, Whitney and Tina Turner. Uh, it's that time, Trevor. It's crunch time. Who are you going to go on a date with? Audience, feel free. Who do you think you should go with? Yeah. Who should you choose? Yeah. Who should you choose? A lot of people for Stephen, a lot of people for Corey. Questions. Trevor, it's not our choice. Mm -mm. Who's it going to be? Is it Corey, Stephen? Excuse me, sir, please. <laughs> please don't interrupt. This is almost certainly the clip they'll play at the Emmys. OK. <laughs> Corey, Stephen or Jude, who's it going to be, Trevor? I'm Make your choice. Going to have now. to say Corey. Chills. Actual chills. <laughs> All right. OK, so it's date time and you are in for a treat cos I am sending you two down the hall <laughs> to stage 58 for a date in our most romantic restaurant set in Television City. OK? <laughs> so have fun. We're going to check in with you later. Ladies and gentlemen, Corey and Trevor, off you go! With Trevor and Corey, now everybody is dying to know how it went. So I'll come to you first, mm. Trevor. How did you think the date went? I think it went really well. I really, really enjoyed my time with him. Um... Yeah. <laughs> Hands up to Corey, because he definitely held his own. Oh, OK. <laughs> and, Corey, what did you think? You'd be as honest as you like. What did you think? Did you enjoy the date? Was it good? It was fantastic. Really? Wow. Oh, my God. I mean, look at him. I mean, you're right. <laughs> I mean, come on. But look at you, Corey. You're also... Well, look. OK, guys, so I'm going to ask you... I'm going to count one, two, three, and you should say yes or no whether you would like to go on another date. Are you ready? Yes. You ready? <laughs> OK. Would you like to go on another date together in, you know, like a proper date, not in our function room down the hall? <laughs> OK. One, two, three... Yes. You two sit there, you carry on. Trevor and Corey, everybody, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow night. Reggie, take us home. <laughs>